Welcome back, DigiDs. Thank you for checking out the channel. And today, we're continuing our adventure here on Halo Infinite. I think this is about episode 7 now. So, hey, if this is your first video for you, you know, feel free to go back, take a look at the other episodes that we have leading up to this point, and following along the story if you are not familiar with it. And uh, other than that, I'd say let's just jump right into it. Now, some of you may be a little bit confused as to why we are outside, as when I even had to go back and double check on the episode of episode 6 that... When we last left off, we were at the top of the tower. However, it did say that my next objective was to go to the excavation site. So when I loaded back into my file here, it for some reason started me outside the tower, like right in this spot. So I suppose we didn't have a whole lot of like story left in the tower. We probably just had to like exit somewhere, I suppose. Cause yeah, when I loaded in, I'm just outside. So I hope we didn't miss anything. No, like, echo logs or something or, like, cores at the top of the tower that I'm not familiar with. Oh, however, now that I think about it, I don't know if I have enough grapple upgrades for this. Let's take a look at our equipment, which we have not taken a look at yet now that I think about it. So if I can remember... There we go. Upgrades. So for our grapple shot, we have a whole bunch of, like, different upgrades that you can have for your different, like... Equipments that you have on you. You have your grapple shot, you have a shield core, you have your threat sensor now that we just got recently. And, excuse me. I'm trying to talk here. Alright, let, <laughs> let me get some cover real quick. They're being rude. Now, now, as I was saying, back to the upgrades. Here we go. So, for the grapple shot, I have it so that it can stun enemies for several seconds. As well as I have the reduced cooldown. So I have zero Spartan cores right now. Cool, so I can't upgrade anything. But I can deliver a powerful shockwave next or increase the damage radius. So it's going to be as fast as it's going to be at this point. It looks like there's no more cooldown stuff. But right now I have three different ones for additional shield capacity. Like shield strength. And the last one I think is just, yep, more shield strength. And then for the threat sensor we haven't unlocked anything yet for it. But it looks like we can increase the, the detection radius by 50%. Add a second charge, which sounds kind of nice. Reduces the threat sensor cooldown by 40%, so that's pretty good. And adds uninterrupted enemy visibility. Now that's now that's probably the best, because threat sensors basically only show them every like couple of seconds when they like pulsate. Now, as... Ah, you know, he's not worth our time. I was going to look at this. Now the reason I even started talking about this, because I remember, I think there is a skull on top of... Nope, that is the wrong button. Let's get back into the swing of things. Come on. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that there's a skull on top of this tower. So I'm going to see, or at least attempt, to see if I can get up there. I don't know how well this is going to go. I'll give it a few attempts. <laughs> but anything more than that is not going to be worth the effort. I can maybe get it in like a different or future episode of trying to go around and find all the skulls. And I'm sliding off. Okay, not a great start. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, dang it. Oh, I caught on. Nice. No, 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 no. Oh, I had it. I had it. All right, one more attempt. Come on. I mean, maybe a couple more. I was really close. Dang it. Oh, it grabbed on. But I still hit the ceiling. Come on, get around, get around. Yes! Perfect. So now, where is it? Oh, we got like a little, like, <laughs> a rock stand set up. We got a guitar. We got a microphone set up in the middle. That's kind of neat. I don't remember this being here. Like, speakers. But, this is what we're here for. As soon as I can... I'm trapped. Help. I'm trapped. <laughs> as soon as we can get up here. There you are. Isn't that just an evil-looking thing? Skulls. You've collected a skull. These mysterious objects are scattered across the Zeta Halo and can modify our gameplay experience. Select your skulls when starting or loading a campaign. Okay. Modify or unlock skull. Is he going to tell me which one? No. However, it does say I can go here. And I have already lost track. Targets, no database skulls so i've collected the 
oh, that I would have been your dad's skull. I think that's one with the Roy rare dialogue, was it? Did they really just say that rare combat dialogues become more common? Yeah. So is there a way to just activate that right now? I'm not certain. Maybe I have to reload and I'll have the availability to do that. But that's pretty cool. So yeah, there are skulls around. Kind of like uh, in the past Halos, they typically, you know, modify your game and whatnot. So yeah, it's kind of exciting to see. So with a little bit of our progress, I guess a little bit catapulted forward and taking a look at that, we do have a new mission, which is go to the excavation site. Which I suppose it says Griffin's intel suggests that the banisher are looking for something at this excavation site. Investigate and disrupt. Cool. Now, however, I do also see that we have multiple fobs along the way. We have one right here that I've selected, one in the center, one off to the right, and one at the north. Is there any up here? Oh, another one over here. So, I say, how about we go take out a couple today and see where that leads us. I'm thinking, let's just try to get the outliers. You know, let's get this one right here in front of me. And then let's go take a little bit of a journey over to Fob Delta. See what's going on up over there, because that way we can take a nice little path all the way through. Or maybe, I don't know if there's even a way for me to get through. If I can zoom in here. There's like this big door system that's going on. If not, then we can always just continue north along this path. Kind of go around the mission site and get the other fob. So yeah. Without further ado, man, look at that. Look at that view, though. That is fantastic. That is just amazing. I love having this new computer. It all looks so beautiful. <laughs> it's not all at like 480p and all the trees in the distance are like weird, like watercolored patterns of unloaded textures. Now it's actually like breathtaking. Dang. Man, I love video games. Well, Geronimo. Let's see if I can do this. Oh, dang, I hit the slide button. Slide for me, will you? Please, thank you. Oh, come on. Maybe I'm not doing it properly. That was disappointing. I am so sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry. But I will see you over there when we reach the fob. All right, we've got the fob platform sitting here right in front of us. Just kind of sitting here behind the tree, try to scope it out, and also to block the sunlight that is just blinding me right now. <laughs> All right, let's go see if we can just grapple our way up to the top. Whoa, I've got a sword for you. This is not a good start. Oh, they've got that powerful brute on the other side. He's got shields. He's probably got... Oh. He's probably got... Oh, he's got a shotgun. Man, I love the sword. A tried and true best. Who shoot me? Get rid of the regular brute. There's no way those missed. Come on. There we go. Who's hiding on the other side? There you go. Get out of here. Excuse me. Oh, I missed. <laughs> I was so close. Oh, there's a dropship above me. I was just about to go grapple into that brute. Did he not drop off troops? Hey, you come back here. Come back here. Get away from the grenade. Oh, that did nothing. Oh, come here. Come here! Come here! <laughs> He's just barely outside my range. Oh, I'm out of ammo, my sword. Fob Echo's ready to be brought back into the fold. Yeah! Just in time. Hang on. And it works. <laughs> Perfect. Let's activate it. One fob down. That'll do it. Fob captured. Looks like we're right on the edge of the island. A chunk of what used to be a single contiguous structure. Can you imagine the force it would take to blow this ring apart? It must have been quite a show. Alright, you know, hey, while this is nearby, let's go take a look. So we've got, I think, it was saying think some troops. There. You're sorely mistaken. <sighs> Fine. 
Confirmed. Oh. Stand by for vehicle drop. I didn't think choosing a vehicle would cancel the dialogue. What can we get for weapons here? I know I haven't unlocked a whole lot yet. I got a grenade, the AR, got a... Ooh. We got the shotgun, we got the sword now. We got last time, and we got that plasma pistol. Can I get a... No BR yet, for some reason. I'm not exactly sure how to unlock these. Maybe they have to be special ones, or maybe I just have to progress. Get more fobs unlocked. And what is that beeping? Ah, the audio log. Let's take a listen while we try to get this guy in. I'm with you. Let's roll. Are you sure about sending him in alone, Dr. Halsey? If everyone does their job correctly, John will not be alone, Captain. I just questioned the value of splitting him off from the rest of Blue Team. That wasn't the initial plan. Plans change. Besides, I have something else for Blue Team in mind. So do I. Which is why we've taken advantage of their unexpected availability to assist elsewhere. I do not remember agreeing to the reallocation of our best Spartans, my Spartans, for an operation I am not even aware of. Plans change, Doctor. You guys suck. <laughs> well, I hope you were able to pay attention to the audio log while they were talking about Blue Team with uh, Professor Halsey, but um, <laughs> my Marine in the back is just blasting people away with a shotgun. <laughs> Alright, so how do I get in there? Do I have to... I probably have to get in and, like, activate a, a switch to open it up. There, the Marines. This must be where they yep. processed prisoners before sending them to the tower. We've got to get them out of here. Did I just walk into a, uh, like a stronghold? I thought this was just... <laughs> I thought I, it just said that there are some Marines that need rescuing. I'm sure I'll find some Marines in here that do need rescuing, but... Bam. <laughs> I'm gonna need rescuing. They just flipped my razor back. Excuse me. Oh, hello. You are dangerous. Oh, yeah, I never replaced my sword. Oh, what got me? I don't even know what shot me there at the end. All right, so plan B. Shoot better. Oh, okay, we're not far back. There we go. Okay, I need it. Okay, that part about shooting better. I should start doing it now. Let me run away first. Just straight up attack on Titan style over my way over the wall. I thought that was supposed to kill you. <laughs> it, you're not dead yet? Thank you. Goodbye. Back over the walls. Oh, another one. Oh, this is not good. This is not good. This is not good. <laughs> Run away as fast as I possibly can. Hello. Thank you. <laughs> I'm very surprised I lived through that. Now it's my turn to fight back. And I'm still almost a dead again. Is there a sniper somewhere? Is that what's going on? Am I being targeted? I am. I am. From where? There you are. Okay, I'm coming for you. No, no, no. You can't hit me. No, you can very well hit me. Oh, I still had my full health and half my shield, but that one shot still took me out. That is terrible. There's no way editing this out. <laughs> I'm stuck with this footage. I'm very sorry. Remember back in like episode one or two where I was just like, man, I don't plan on dying at all. It's going to be hard to die in heroic. I'm going to have to do something stupid to die. <laughs> Fast forward till now. I hear another beeping. 
It's just another audio log that we can listen to. Hiding away up here somewhere. Please, work with me. There is. Let's give that a listen while I annihilate this sniper. Interesting. And I finally got that sniper, and I see what's going on here. They're all on turrets. I need to take those out. And you are carrying a turret, which seems a little unfair. Get rid of you. And you. And can I just take this out? I probably have just enough ammo left to take it out. There we go. Grab a weapon, my fellow humans. Yes. Fight back. You're free. Now, you, sir, are being a real annoyance. You are still shooting me. Let me take out everyone else that I can real quick. That's super easy. Okay, am I gonna have enough ammo for this? Probably not. Let me take care of that jackal. That's why we don't need ammo where I'm going. Yes, I do need ammo. Run away again. Yeah, I'm out of ammo. Okay, so my options are either punch them or find another weapon. I'm a little inclined to punch them right now, but I'm not so certain. Give me your plasma pistol. Thank you. Oh, an armory. That's exactly what we need. Uh, Pulse carbine is not going to be all right, but you know, I'll take a mangler. I'm starting to warm up to the mangler. I mean, it is powerful, as long as you can hit your shots. Hey, Marines. Let's get you out of here. I, can't believe I'm out of there. Thank you. And I think there's still one more, it's saying. Get ready. More reinforcements inbound. Don't worry, I got you. Because I'm gonna need all the support I can, excuse me. Let me get out of here. No, 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 no. <laughs> they still chased me down while I'm sprinting away. Oh, how dare they. I didn't even get to see their face as I died. Man, I'm surprised. I was sprinting away and they still caught up to me. Oh, we're right back into it. Get ready. More reinforcements inbound. Still up on ammo this time. Ooh. Do I want the bulldog? Apparently, I don't want the bulldog. They took it. <laughs> Blast them. You know, I'll take your needler. Or, wow. Excuse me. I'll take your BR and you take my needler. I want to need the help, Marines. Yeah. Take them out. Let's go! <laughs> you know, I do appreciate the AI in this game. They, they are a lot better this time around. They're actually a little bit more helpful. They fire more often. They're more accurate. Let's take up anyone that's high up that was probably shooting me before. Nothing? No. Okay. Ooh, but we do have a Spartan core sitting there and some kinetic ammo. Perfect, that's one more point. 
And yes, I am aware. I saw that sniper red glare. Where? Oh, there he is. Not anymore. <laughs> Who's next? Anyone? Oh, I can't throw that. The Marines are right there. That's right. Move away. Perfect. You know, I need to waste ammo on this. Let's punch it. Yeah, one punch. Free the squad leader. All right. Yeah, will you? <laughs> I'm picking up one last UNSC tag inside that central holding structure. No, 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 no. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Run away. Thank you. <sighs> I'll take a little bit of that. I think that console's weak to his cage. I like it. Oh, please don't kill me, Marines. That would be the way to go that I get killed in, again, but by my own allies that are helping me this entire time. Ooh, you know what? Let me take out these enemies first. Thank you. Okay, never mind. It's just him. You all right, Marine? Yeah. I am now. Chief, we thought you were dead. Thank you. No problem. I mean, I thought I was dead too, technically. The Chief was... is out of banished control. We're two for two on gate crashing prisons. The Marines probably want to burn this place to the ground, but at least there'll be no more prisoners processed here. So you say. Got one more audio log here at the end. Do not misunderstand my concern, Kaidan. None would question your vigilance in safeguarding the processing outpost. Nevertheless, it is insufficient. We must never forget what happened during the war. A single demon rose from the ashes of their worlds and brought the whole of the Covenant to its knees. We believed him to be dead before, but were proven wrong to our utter shame. We cannot afford to make that mistake again. Ah, so they keep thinking I'm dead. You know, in a way that we kind of have risen from, like, the ashes of, like, war. Although, technically speaking, the Spartans were originally made to handle, like, rebels in the outer colonies and stuff. In, like, hey, lore against other humans. They weren't even... I don't think they were even aware of the Covenant yet. At least not well known that I know of. And then all of a sudden they attacked. And then the Spartans came in handy. So they were originally created to fight other humans. It's kind of a big part of, like, Halsey's war crime. And, well, and the fact that she, like, kidnapped... <laughs> hundreds of children only to have them all brutally die in experiments but you know that's besides the point but she always like tries to defend the point saying like well they literally saved the like galaxy like the entire galaxy it's like well <laughs> it's like don't try to write your wrongs like well <laughs> you know even she did have uh you know ulterior motives as to why she made the spartans originally they did kind of save the world and galaxy several times over especially chief here so but hey another spartan core <laughs> are there other, any others nearby so there are other other oh, squads nearby let's go let's go save this squad behind us And then maybe that'll be the last thing we do for this episode. Because then, I'm thinking next episode, I know we. I want to check out, see if I can get to this fob. But as well, I want to then clear out this side. I want to get to this squad. These two Spartan Corps, that squad. Another Spartan Corps. Or what are these? These are armories. And then we've also got a target that we can kill for a new weapon. And another squad. <laughs> a lot of squads on that side. That can be a nice little episode of just uh, clearing out that entire section. And then maybe even clearing out this one at the end. But for now, let's quit babbling on what we're gonna do. And just go do what we're gonna do for now. Because I do what I do. <laughs> and then just be how it is. I'm 
Are you following? A UNSC distress signal. It's pretty close by. I can hear it. It's very close by. I mean, technically, I would probably hear these shots from much further away. Thank you. <laughs> mm, I think I'll keep my weapons as are for now. Hostile reinforcements inbound. Elio. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Let me just take out uh, that fusion coil right now before it spins into all of us and just <laughs> kills three marines. Because that's exactly what it would do. Eliminated. The squad made it. Thanks to you. Really, that was it. Dang, well, that was pretty simple. Well, all right. Oh, you got the stock rifle, man. I might. Oh, can I give you the gravity? No, I can't. Ah, oh, man. Huh. No, it's probably are better you, in your hands. You Maybe I'll get a right razor now, back. Chief. <laughs> but thank you guys up. for checking out the video. Hey, if you liked watching it, feel free to hit the subscribe button, hit that like button. And it really helps out the channel and get kind of started in the algorithm of maybe people being able to stop by and check out uh, the same content that you're also enjoying. So thank you for stopping by, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.